Hey guys, it's Derek here. We're gonna play a little bit of Maquette. Maquette is a puzzle game set in a nested world of different models and stuff. Um, will make sense when we get into it, but basically it's manipulating a small model world that eventually affects the larger world outside of you and then an even bigger world outside of that and so on. Okay, so I've skipped ahead a little bit. Um, I skipped past the first chapter mostly because there's no actual real puzzle solving in it. It's just um, introducing you to what the buttons do more or less. This is the second chapter. So the second chapter is called Maquette, so that probably makes sense to start here. So you can see we're in a, like a small model world. Um, some areas are blocked off. You can see outside of that that there's an even bigger world up there. And in here that we can't get to just yet, but there is a smaller world in there too. So let us get started. So the basic premise of Maquette is you uh, find a scrapbook that like jogs your memory about a relationship you had and these puzzles basically resembles like pages from that scrapbook and that kind of thing. To be honest, it's the kind of not that great of a, of a story, but the puzzles are interesting and the mechanics are fun too. The sketchbook opened right to the drawing we made the day we first met at that coffee shop. Alright, I forgot I have captions on. Uh, hey, sorry, um, do you mind if I sit here while I yes. wait for my coffee? Oh, very much uh, so. Yeah, knock yourself out. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. No, okay, well, you I'm absolutely so can't sit here now. Is your sketchbook okay? Um, yeah, unscathed. It's, uh, it's just doodles anyway. Can I see it? Oh, um, absolutely not. Oh, this is a cool castle. <laughs> Thanks. I, uh, I just started drawing again. I used to sketch constantly, and then, I don't know, I just stopped. So did I. Same, dude, Actually, there was same. there in elementary school when I was the girl who was good at drawing. Oh, I was never good at it. I remember that girl. Everyone was always like, oh, please, will you help me with my poster? How do I draw hands? Exactly. <laughs> Nobody knows how to draw hands. It's a, it's a mystery. I'm five years old. <laughs> well, let's see how far you've come since your toddler years. <laughs> This would this would never happen. Hey, there is no right or wrong way to draw in a sketchbook. <laughs> yes, there is. <laughs> yes, there yes there uh, is. Wow, that's my order. That was fast. Um, I'm Kenzie, by the way. I'm Michael. It's nice to meet you. I just gotta run. So what Bye. did you what did you draw in that five seconds? Not even five seconds. Anyway. No, that world's still not available to us. Okay, so what do we have to do? It's been a while. I have actually finished the game. I just, it's been a while since I actually played it the first time. Oh yeah, yeah. You just go back, I think, and the, the model world opens. Yeah. Cool effect. Every day was romantic. No, it wasn't. I don't think we ever did the boring old get drinks in a bar routine. No, you did the get drinks in a coffee shop routine instead. Anyway, model world, hooray! So, giant red cube. Where's the giant red cube? Giant red cube. It's in the way. I can't get in there. It's far too big for me to pick up. Game won't even let me pick it up. Unless... I pick it up in here. And now, I can either drop it back into the model world, or I can drop it outside the model world. So if I put it in the model world, if I put it in the model world, shit, I forget how to do this. Circle, okay. I can put it in the model world and just plonk it down. Fuck. Now it's over there. Or I can take it out of the model world. Plonk it there instead. Plonk it there instead. <laughs> Yay, there it is. And I can take it out again. And do it again. I <laughs> know it is so small I can't even pick it up. Oh wait, no. Hang on. Come here. This is this is gonna be a mistake. Anyway. Okay. Is it there? Can you see it? It's fucking tiny, but it's right there. It's right to the just above the cursor. Anyway, it's so small I can't actually pick it up, so there is a limit to how far you can go on. 
this isn't important. I don't think the cube is actually used ever again. So I'm just going to put it over in the corner and forget about it because it's never, it's never used again. Now we're in here. Now we're in this world. But I can't, I can't get across this chasm. We spent afternoons drawing together on backyard patios in the Mission District. Mission District? Okay. What's down here? No. No. Okay. Uh, stuff in here? Picnic brunches in parks. That's, that's cliche as well, you know. Anyway, elevator. Other, other side of the elevator. What's up here? Nothing. Yeah, I know. You said that already. Maybe they had two. Hey, what's this? I wonder if this is useful. Maybe we should take it with us. You know, if this was bigger, it could probably fit across the gap. I wonder how we do that. How do we make it bigger? Wait a minute. I have this whole magical model thing. Maybe I can do it. Scale. And plunk. Incredible. With this power, I could probably not do much. But anyway. Wrong button. Playing too many games. I sure hope this isn't copyrighted music. Picnic brunches in parks. I know. He's all about them picnic bunches. Picnic bunches? Yeah, why not? You buy them in the supermarket. Three for two picnic bunches. This is almost certainly copyrighted. Watching the stars come out on rooftop gardens downtown. Also cliche. First month we spent together I realized how small a world I'd made for myself before we met. Now we have this world because we needed this ticket but it's way too big so you gotta small it up a little bit so I'll leave it there and <laughs> hang on there it is now how that fits in don't ask questions I sure hope this music stops soon. Okay, there we go. I can't hear myself think. Can you smell that? Oh, yeah, it smells I like smell fart. It. Now this takes me back. Welcome to the fair. Oh, the fair, Not it definitely smells like fart. I pictured it. What did you imagine? You saw my drawing, you know, circus tents and stuff. Well, a county fair is nothing like circus. I don't know, but I don't know. I just kind of assumed. Hold on, your parents never took you to the fair? No, no, fuck you, dude. Oh, you are gonna have to set your bar a thousand times lower. Think like, like a farm, but with a lot more deep fried stuff, and tube tops, and twenty dollar beers. Will they at least have a Ferris wheel? Okay, yeah, that is the one thing you sketch that we probably will see here. But it won't look like the janky one you drew. <laughs> really? No, it will be even jankier. I mean, these rides, they're death traps, and, and that's all part of the thrill. Well, hang on. If you know it's a death <laughs> trap, why are you getting on it? $20 beers, and death traps? That's setting the bar plenty high for me. It is not. I can't wait to get out of here. I am now stuck. Stuck in horror land. Can I pick any of this up? No. Some $20 beers right here. No one could stop me taking them. Oh, there were things we both secretly wanted, but thought were too strange or cheesy to articulate. But with you, everything was easy. 
Cheesy and easy. Easy, cheesy, squeezy peas. Now introducing Christmas easy, squeezy, cheesy peas. They're easier, <laughs> they're squeezier, <laughs> they're cheesier, and they are peasier. And I'm sure two people maybe got what that reference is about. So I can activate this in the model, since I can't get past the wall in the main world. The main world. I mean, it's kind of arbitrary that this one is the main world, but whatever. That knocked down the wall. Now I can get past. I pick up this thing. Oh, you want to try this fortune telling machine? I do not. I don't know. What, you don't like these? I'm not superstitious, but if I get a bad fortune, I feel like it's some kind of doomed self fulfilling prophecy. That is being superstitious. Not necessarily. When I was a kid, one of those things told me my pet turtle Pinky would die, and she did. Well, well, unfortunately, that is part of the turtle life cycle. They do die. It was a Galapagos turtle. <laughs> no, it wasn't. No, but she did die a few days later. Okay, we don't have to do it. No, 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 no. Just because it's I don't. It's not like Galapagos <laughs> turtles aren't immortal. Yeah. They die too. What does it say? Um, nothing. Michael? <laughs> I guess they do give bad fortune sometimes. Oh. Yeah, you were right. So what did it say? <laughs> it's not going to tell us what it said. It said your relationship is doomed. And if you play more of this game, uh, that does come true. Anyway. First held hands on the Ferris wheel, which might have been corny. He's just saying that they didn't do the, the, the boring or the boring basic stuff. But it was windy and the gondola shook and we held each other close. I'm sure it was lovely. Okay, I got a key. That one is closed off and now that I've left, that one is also closed off. So the game, it doesn't kind of let you wander exactly. You are kind of free or not. It kind of railroads you into what the next puzzles are. It's like, obviously the next puzzle is this area. Giant key. Clunk. Now we get in here. But, can't get over there. I thought our first kiss wasn't that far behind. Well, I can't get over there, so maybe we can retrieve the bridge from the last place? Where was that? Ugh, bridge. Oh no, I can't pick it up. For arbitrary reasons, I still haven't figured out that the game won't let you pick it up. Anyway. You can, however, retrieve the key. And now we can use the key as a bridge but you know what we can also do before we do that we can also use the key Let's see if i can do this now because it's uh, kind of tricky yeah yeah okay so if i drop it okay that should work you can use the key to get out boing I'm out in the big world now. No one can stop me. No one can stop Tiny Man in the big world. Now, I think it stops you from getting all the way out into the next world by making this jump impossible. Yeah, okay, so you, you can't go out again. So there is a limit to the nest, which is unfortunate. I kind of was kind of hoping that the nesting would like keep going and you'd end up in like ridiculously huge world or ridiculously tiny world. Um, you can also see that this is currently our max our maximum speed uh, and there's some weirdness about uh, where you're able to go really fast and in some places they make you go really slow i think it's like a um, it's probably like a velocity limiting thing so you don't end up going ridiculously fast i may have i may have fucked us <laughs> i may i may have screwed us over guys oh god <laughs> I mean, we might have to reset our position. 
Oh, I can't see shit. Maybe I can climb these. <laughs> One second. Um, don't think we can get back up now. Oh god, I can't even make this step. Oh, hang on. If I jump at an angle, maybe I can. See, it wants it wants to give it to me, but I end up on this lip and it won't let me. Okay, well, hang on, maybe I can go, up, ah, I can go up the railing, that's fine. Okay, we're out, we're good. Um, if you do happen to end up in a position where you can't figure out how to get out, there is a, like, restart from your autosave and you'll be fine. Um, anyway, let's get, let's get back into the model. There's, you can see there is, like, there is a bigger world outside of it, but how well it's detailed or whatever, I, I find it unlikely that it's that well detailed since I don't think you can get to it. But there is a door that lets us back in, which is helpful. Ooh, that was a bad effect. Anyway. <laughs> that didn't look great. All right, back to what we were, what we were gonna be doing. So we use the key to make a bridge and push it out a bit. Oh, back in. Damn it, not enough. So even though the shadows lined up and everything, it still didn't give it to me. There we go. Now we're across. Amazing. And here it is. Wow, this place is great. Isn't it? What do you call it? Just the secret spot, I guess. I've walked past here a million times. I never knew this was here. It's just what above the um, vaginal well, opening. The, the me. secret spot. Yeah. <laughs> they have no idea we're up here. You do know what the word secret means, right? Oh, come on. You don't think anyone knows about this? No, I put that little guardian owl in there. Oh, so he keeps it safe? No, dude, he's made of wood. I just think he'd be gone or vandalized if anyone else had been here. I really think I'm the only one who knows. But if he was made of something else, would he have protected the place? I've never shown this place. He's made of a highly radioactive material. If anybody comes in here, they get radiation poisoning. Okay. But now what? Now what do we do? Can I take you with me? No. Okay. Smash to black. I have to run to work. You've got the address for tonight? Yeah. When should I get there? Well, Never. Don't go. Off at seven. This is a bad idea. My shift isn't done till nine. But if Aaron shows up, I can get out at... So, what time should I get there? Get there when you get there. If I'm not there, just introduce yourself. No, God, horrible. I'll see you then. Can't think of anything worse. God, yes, I'll just go to a place where I don't know anybody and wait for my girlfriend to show up. And I don't know when she's going to be showing up. So, we've got another, um, I can't make this jump situation. And for arbitrary reasons, they won't let us take this bridge. Even though it's shining and whatever, but well, whatever, we're not allowed to take it. The problem here is that we can do the same thing. All right. I, get, I need to get into the map. We can do the same thing and drop the key. All right, same deal. The problem is when you get across, you need the key. You need, you need the key to actually open uh, the door. So, how do how do you get across? And I am saying this as if I actually know the solution, and I'll be with you in a moment. But <laughs> kind of drawing a blank on how you do this again. I think 
I think you have to open the door first and then make the bridge, so... Damn it, I did it again. If you drop it from like inside this maquette area, it's kind of really difficult to actually pick it up. And you can see like right in there, there is another maquette, which I don't think you can ever get to. So the game is a tiny bit misleading, which isn't, you know, it's not great. But anyway, uh, I think you can now open the door with this key. That's a weird, that's a weird way to open a door anyway. But then you pick it back up and drop it out. How have I not gotten that trophy? Okay, did I find it? Did I somehow find another way to solve this puzzle? I did that wrong. I did that wrong. Come here. Uh, I need to drop you off. Ugh. I need to drop you off in here. And then pick you up. Ugh. Come here. Come here. Put you back out. Ugh. Ugh. So the, the game does lock onto objects, so occasionally you can get that kind of weirdness where it auto locks while you're moving. Anyway, puzzle solved. Loud party music. My there own personal are. hell. Hey. How long have you been here? I was just about to ask you the same. Who are you talking to? Uh, Everybody. Friends, tall they... tail, heavy eyeliner. Guy or girl? Girl. Oh, and she's not my friend friend she's a friend of a friend but still a friend oh yeah love her but i want to introduce you to my really close friends well and gave me a whirlwind tour of introductions already oh yeah and they all knew who i was oh yeah i am um quote unquote kenzie's bestie Oof. roommate tom actually insisted that i have been your co-worker for two years oh my god michael i'm I, i'm so sorry that's so <laughs> oops kenzie I am not good with... Can can we go somewhere to talk? Yeah, my, my room's down here. Not the talk. You know, I'm, I'm not good with things like making moves or whatever, but I didn't think that... <sighs> We're not just friends, are we? I mean, just friends. Michael, look. <laughs> you know how difficult it is to actually get a friend? You, but these last couple weeks honestly i feel like i'm in a dream pretty much the entire time and it's actually a video game and no we're not just friends we're actually friends with benefits anyway that um was the second chapter of maquette now we are into the third one but i am going to leave it there because one the game is kind of short um oh my god this is definitely copyrighted music. I have got to I've got to speed this up. Get me out of here! Get me out of here! Okay, fuck. That music's not gonna stop. Uh unless you solve a bunch of puzzles that I forget how to do. So <laughs> we're just gonna call it there. Anyway, that was a bit of maquette, as I was gonna say before I was rudely copyright taken down by this video, and you might even be able to see it, who knows? Maquette is kind of short, and also because it's a puzzle game, you can get through it fairly fast if you know what you're doing, which I do because I've played the game before, so uh, I'm not going to do uh, too long on this. But I hope you liked uh, this video. You can check out Maquette. Um, it is on uh, PlayStation, I believe, and also PC. was free at one stage on PlayStation Plus, which is how I got it. Uh, I thought I would give it a, a look. The puzzle mechanics are interesting. I just don't think they go far enough now that I've played the whole thing. Um, there's only only three layers that they go with the nesting um which is a little disappointing i would have liked them to have gone kept going with it but i guess that would be very complicated to make into a puzzle anyway thanks for watching guys uh, and i will see you next time mm -hmm.